Philly had a hard time shooting the ball, you know, 41, 42 percent. That's a really tough shot by Kelly. Davis will fire away and drain it. That'll be a two-pointer. And that's RJ. Sturdivant lost the dribble a little leaner, and he airmailed it right to Davis. He is not waiting around. Look at this spin move and drops it in. A whirling dervish. He's an excellent foul shooter. You could tell missing that game last Sunday. It's affected Armando's condition, and that's one of those things again when you when you have to miss time, you leave as the career all-time leading rebounder here, and no asterisk beside it because it would only be in four years. You know, not not a COVID year for him. Josh Pastor has to be happy with the offense for his team, and now gaining the lead. It's a team that only makes 30 percent from three-point land. Davis will try and answer, and he does. He has nine. first half, maybe not a hundred percent. What you'd expect for him, and I think there's a lot of focus on what they did last year, and the expectations obviously went through the roof because he's in obviously in the NCAA tournament. They absolutely did finish the season 11 and two, but they were coming off of a stretch where they were beaten here on their home court versus Pittsburgh. They were losing a number of games where everyone's trying to figure it out. But the reality, Terry with a three. And now I'll tell you what, Seth trembles everywhere. How about the bounce speed? Davis with two. Took it. Something more power in his way in. And OB, let me make it clear. The Tar Heels cannot be a national championship contender without Caleb Love. Davis out to guard. Kelly catches and shoots, but it's not there. They got well on his way to another double-double. He has seven rebounds, already into double figures scoring. Love will swing. Davis bouncing for Baycott, who came in averaging 16 points and 11 rebounds a game. Davis gets himself a good look and drains it. Which is the best on the team. And looking for his 19th point today here against the Yellow Jackets. And more up for the rebound. He understands his role on this team, and he knows that his role is growing to be more aggressive, be more of a score, so Georgia Tech can be successful. Love kicking it back out. Davis from two point land sticks it. We've seen RJ gets over. Hopefully, Mondo's able to stay healthy. He will leave North Carolina as the number one all time leading rebounder. At this historic program. Speaking of history, how is it that the greatest player to ever play the game of basketball, Michael Jordan, is not in the College Basketball Hall of Fame? Now, I know there will be people who say, well, he was a much better NBA player than he was a college basketball player.